all set and uh, when racing. Got them way to a nice start over here. Beginning well was Total Surrender. The Black Cap Raffles also began nicely. Poor little Rich Girls up there handy too. Willow's Wish takes a seat behind those. Three wide outside of River Romeo and Quasi's Lady. Further back to home of the Brave. Twa Twa Cut gives them seven to eight length starts. Racing behind that Viva Brazil and Battleground is the trailer. Going past the mile start and poor little rich girl is now the leader. It's poor little rich girl gone away by a good two and a half to three lengths from total surrender it back in second. In third is Raffles with Willow's Wish racing away in fourth position. They're well spread out over here. Further back to the inside came Quasi's Lady, racing there with River Romeo. Further back then to Twa Twa Cut, who's eight or nine lengths off the leader. Home of the Brave gives him company. At the back of Viva Brazil and Battleground, as they approach the 1,000-meter mark, there's got to be 10 lengths from it from first to last. Poor little rich girl about to take the turn into the home straight. Let it by a good three lengths from total surrender. Another two lengths back to Willow's Wish and Raffles race together. A further two lengths away to Quasi's Lady. Then came River Romeo. Twa Twa Cut's got eight lengths to make up with Home of the Brave behind those. Then Viva Brazil and Battleground as they become homeward bound. Reaching the last 600 meters now. Poor little rich girl's a big leader by four lengths or so from total surrender and raffles. Willow's Wish is down the center of the track. Behind that came Twa Twa Cut who now starts to run on. Quasi's Lady, home of the Brave, is also running on nicely behind those. And here comes Viva Brazil on the outside of the track. It's still Poor Little Rich Girl taken on by Raffles, 250 to go. Poor Little Rich Girl, the leader of length. Raffles now moves up on the outside, total surrender. Willow's Wish is again caught in a pocket. Yes, Viva Brazil quickens up really well. Then only came Twa Twa Cut, it's Raffles. Viva Brazil, Poor Little Rich Girl's fighting back. Back on the rail, Raffles coming home strongly with Viva Brazil, maybe Raffles, or Viva Brazil from poor little rich girl, Willow's Wish, and behind that total surrender. Came battleground. Here's a look at the head-on replay with poor little rich girl on the rail, Raffles between them, and Viva Brazil, and the David Shaw colours on the outside will provide Lucky Udalakas with a double on the meeting. Raffles, Viva Brazil, poor little rich girl, three short heads, and it goes the way of Viva Brazil. Number nine has got up to win it from Raffles in second. Poor little rich girl nearly uh, collided with the rail in the closing stages. And behind them were Willow's Wish and Total Surrender. That's the running of race seven. Still two more to go. A nice close finish here. Got up, getting up short of the line here was Viva Brazil. Brilliant. Well, we've been treated to a uh, finish in the half there to race number seven. This was a race also known as Association Merit Rate of 97. Contested over the 2,000 metres, I do know that the ROA are entertaining some guests, and I'm sure this would have just certainly enhanced uh, their love for the game. Their guests are in uh, box number 11, I do believe. I'm giving away secrets there. But to one honour to uh, Sabedo, he looks after uh, Viva Brasilia, or Viva Brazil rather, and it is a uh, Rambo on his behalf collecting that uh, winner's uh, winning groom at check. Well done to Sabir and well done to you guys. The stable is certainly turned. Yeah, thanks very much, sir. I would like to say big well done to Karen, big well done to our boss, and a big well done to our big big boss. Okay. So, and a team at a whole. Okay. No, well done to for this one. It's a double on the day, yeah? <laughs> Thanks very much. Thank you very much. That is a for Sabella. Thank you very much. All right, let's talk to the man who was involved in that uh, finish, a regular friend of ours here in uh, the winner's enclosure. Caden, first time aboard uh, Viva Brazil, you asked and you got a response. You got up to the other horses and it was heads up, heads down. Literally a nostril, I think, has separated the, the first two. Yes, 100% it was a race that went all the way down to the wire. So I just have to say a big thanks, Mr. Lucas, for preparing the horse to perfection. He, he did everything that... Uh, he needed before the race and pressing the button he gave me everything and it was very nice to just get there on the line He's been good to you over the years. He's been giving you chances huh? Yes, 100% Mr. Lucas has been supporting me from my apprentice days from before I even moved up to Joburg So I just want to say a big thank you to him for all the support he's given me all throughout my career Well done for this one and a great finish indeed yeah, thanks again to Mr. Woodlockers. I want to thank Mr. David Shaw. It's my first winner for him. It's been a lot of rides in these colours, so it's nice to finally crack that first winner for him. So just appreciate him for them being here and them being on the course for a special moment for them. Indeed, well done for this, and I'm sure they'll be happy with the performance of the other, but we'll talk to Lucky about that one. Well done. 100%, thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Woodlockers. 
Viva Brasilia. This is an oratorio out of a uh, Jet Master Mayor, Little Jet Bread by the owner, Mr. David Shaw. And of course, just touching on the other one, whom you said is on the mend and a certainly a decent comeback run. Yeah, I thought all three of them ran well. And yeah, you, I heard you telling him what, that I've given him a few chances or whatever. But he keeps firing me. So, oh, boy, stop uh, yeah, up. no, he, he keeps <laughs> firing me. So, yeah, anyway, but um, yeah, I was a bit nervous when we landed up that far behind and um, I was wondering whether we we're going to make it up. But um, yeah, he's a progressive horse and I'm just glad we got our head in front. Um, and yeah, happy for Dave. Nice race. Um, it was, I think it's time to try a bit further. And uh, yeah, and as I say, his other one, Total Serena, I thought he ran a much better race. He's starting to get there. And even my other one, Battleground, you know, with the 10 furlong, I, I would just watch now. It was nice to see him finishing it off. And yeah, nice day. Well done to my whole team and very happy. So will we see you Brazil on the 6th of April? That's a longer trip. He put you on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's something we'll discuss, you know. Like I say, it, it's tough, you know. You, you end up, you run a good race and these handicappers will smash you and you're dead for the next six months. You know, you try and if you realise you're not good enough, you, you've, you've realised you're not good enough, but the handicapper still whacks you. So you, you're pretty much dead for the next couple of months until you drop. But you know what, we'll see. You, it's only three ones. We'll have a, maybe we'll have a crack at it and... Because, you know, there's not going to be much time now to, from now to then to try him over a, you know, 2 4 and all that. So, yeah, we'll discuss it with him. But, yeah, I'm, I am under pressure and I pretty much know the route. Okay. But well done to Dave. Thank That's so the most much. important. Well done for the double lucky. Mr. David Shaw, owner breeder, we will uh, await the outcome of the discussions. But uh, Viva Brasilia, I keep following Brasilia because I love my uh, <laughs> South American football. Viva Brazil going about it the right way and uh, what a show about there in the finish yeah look um, it was tight um, I, I wasn't sure we got up but uh, yeah so glad we did indeed so uh, now obviously the sky is the limit I'm not going to put you under them you two guys have to discuss what you have to do but uh, we really appreciate your participation and uh, your uh, breeding operation seems to be expanding yeah very much so I actually flew in this morning uh, I was in Cape Town for a little while I flew in uh, many to make the races today because uh, we thought the three horses would run well and got a third and a win so happy with that and uh, my friends in Cape Town had a win in the first so well done to them but uh, yeah all hats off to Lucky I think um, you know the horses are ticking over well with him and uh, he's doing well and to the whole yard there congratulations Caden his first winner for me so thank you Caden uh, well done but I'm sure there's many more to come he's a young up and coming jock so nice to give him opportunities and we'll definitely be going for it um, as far as that race in two weeks time yeah like Lucky like says you know unfortunately if you run a, a dirty third or fourth you know you can get penalized heavily so it's a consideration but at the same time you know, they're only three years old once, so it'll be an interesting conversation in the next few days. Indeed, and of course, I'm sure you're happy with the return to form of total surrender, slowly getting back. Yeah, he uh, colicked quite badly. He got rushed to hospital. Fortunately, he didn't need to cut him, um, but he's, uh, he took the colic very, very bad. That was a few months ago, and it's, it's been a slow graduate um, return. Um, so, yeah, I think um, his next run or two, I think he'll start seeing the horse that he is. So, yeah, looking forward to that. We we'll await whatever comes out of uh, the uh, stable, but uh, for now, enjoy this one and thank you for talking to us. No, thank you very much and uh, well done again to Lucky and Caden and um, yeah, upwards and onwards from you. Thank, thank you, you so much. Wish you well. That is Mr. David Shaw of Titanium Racing. Of course, those silks, if you don't know them by now, I think uh, you have been away for quite some time from racing. Certainly enjoying a good season. That is Viva Brazil coming through to make it win number three from just eight outings. Caden Brewer, Lucky Udalakis. And of course, it is a well done to all at the stable. The stable has certainly turned.